Hello everybody and welcome back to Mr. P channel. Thank you very much for joining me again. Let me explain what I'm all talking in this video. <clears throat> a couple of days ago I was playing Skyrim on the Sh Cl Shadow Cloud Gaming service with my Xbox One controller and after playing for about five, I think five or ten minutes, the controller stopped working. And I mean, I couldn't do nothing. Uh, I couldn't basically, my, my, my character was constantly running because it's basically stopped working while I was running and it's basically, I couldn't do nothing. I, I, I got killed. So then I thought, okay, maybe my Xbox One controller is damaged. It's not working anymore. So what I did, I used one of my old ones. I used this Xbox 360 USB controller. And I was playing Skyrim, I was playing Witcher 3, but then again, within about 10 minutes or so, it stopped working again. And basically the character, whatever the last input was happening, it was just keep repeating. So if, let's say, you, like I said, if, you, if you're running or your character is running and your, your controller stops working, the character is basically gonna keep running forever until it's gonna get killed. So I was wondering what is happening that the both controllers stopped working around the same time and apparently there is a bug deck station when you're on a note 9 deck station when you're using a deck station you have an option with note 9 which is called dual screen as you see here uh, the screenshot uh, by engaged and this the screenshot is from Samsung Unbox event where they were demoing the new deck station the new decks and the note 9 as you see uh, they have a deck station running, they're playing a video or, so, or, or something like, and the guy's replying to a text message same time. So basically my Note 9, 9 does the same thing. I have a deck station and I have my phone in front of me on the left. It's right now telling me 1927, I have access to a homepage, whatnot, etc, etc. My phone sleep time or my display sleep time is set to, at the moment, to 20 minutes. When my controllers were disconnecting, my sleep time was set to 10 minutes. So the bug is, it's all fine when you were playing the game when the both screens are active. But when you're playing the game with a controller, there is no input to your screen and your screen turns off. And when your screen turns off, for some reason, the controllers stop working as well. So technically there is a gaming bug on Note 9 with a dual screen <coughs> setup. But don't worry, the, the, there is a fix. So, uh, and the fix is basically you've already, if you're watching my videos, you probably already have this app. Uh, I'll, 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 I'm, gonna, I'm gonna show it to you anyway. So if you don't have that one, you just go to Google Play Store and search for Desktop Hub. You probably, like I said, you, you already have this app. It's created by a company called Touch Technologies. And this is an app that just basically enhances and makes your deck station experience even better. <clears throat> but recently, what the developer of, of this app from Touch Technologies, what they've done, they introduced the, um, what's this called, dual screen gaming mode. I believe he possibly mentioned that in the, in the description of this app, uh, fix game mode on devices running Android Pie, etc. etc. Well, anyway, I'll show you what the fix is. So, I already got this app download. By the way, it's like very good app if you're using a deck station, it's a very good app. And let's open up here. You go so, desktop hub. And there's an option here dual screen gaming mode. So, if I click on the eye icon. It gives you a description. On Samsung DeX, when running a dual screen mode on supported devices, if the phone screen goes off, then various input types will stop responding, such as analog stick, sticks, triggers on game controllers. So what's happened is I was running on a Skyrim pressing up and it suddenly disconnected, but my character was still running. And the same with trigger. Uh, I was playing is a Witcher free when I was attacking some somebody, and basically the phone stopped. Uh, the phone, the, the control stopped working while the trigger was pressed, and my character was keep attacking. Keep let's say you can keep using bullets, whatever, whatnot. 
it's just no more input because the phone screen goes off. So next uh, paragraph, Desktop Hub provides a very simple fix which is to enable you to force the phone screen to stay on while making the phone screen stay black to reduce the likelihood of screen burn in. This is likely to be fixed in the near future by Samsung, but until they fix this, I will provide you with workaround. So thank you very much, developer. So basically what the guy, the developer did, when you press start gaming mode, my phone screen goes off. My phone screen is being turned off. I, I cannot, my phone screen is totally black. And there is an icon appears here, which it says desktop hub. So if I expand this, uh, you probably won't be able to see, but it tells me that dual dex gaming mode is on. So basically this gives me, there you go, dual dex gaming mode, stop gaming mode, and my phone screen will go back on again. So my phone screen just lits up again. So basically it's like it's forcing to display a black color across entire page, entire, sorry, entire screen. And because the Samsung screens is our AMOLED screen, the black pixel is actually turned off pixel. So it's not like you're damaging the screen because every single pixel in on entire phone screen is being turned off as soon as you press start the gaming mode uh, fix. My phone, by the way, makes a bit of like a, a, a strange uh, noise when I start. It's just like a notification. So here we are. That's that's this is a fix uh, from. Uh, the developers of desktop hub if you notice that your controller just stopped working randomly with no reason at all this is the reason why <laughs> there is a small bug and like like developer mentioned is possibly going to be fixed by samsung in the near future but at the moment this is a very 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 good workaround if you do a lot of gaming on your deck station and suddenly your controller just stops working i hope you enjoyed this video i hope this video is useful for you let me know in the comment section below what you think. Uh, please click like if you enjoyed, enjoyed watching me talking about this. And please, cons please consider to subscribing if you're not done already. Because I, well, I do all these things. I test Android games and apps on various Android devices. And basically going from A to Z exactly what DeckStation can do. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next one. Bye-bye.